for our fourth question we want the equation of a line which is perpendicular to this line and is at this distance from the origin so from y minus 5x is equal to 0 we get y is equal to 5x so therefore the slope m1 is 5 and if our line is perpendicular to it then our line m2 must be minus 1 by m1 which is equal to minus 1 by 5. So we know that our line is sum y is equal to minus x by 5 plus c. If we kind of simplify it we are going to get 5y plus x is equal to c. This c is not the same thing as the previous c. I have just used it as c because it is an arbitrary constant which is yet to be determined. Otherwise, it should have been 5c. Anyway, now we have to find the value of this c in this equation. For that, we are going to use the next bit of information that is given to us which is the distance from the origin. So, this line has this distance from the origin. So, the distance from a point formula is ax1 plus by1 plus c divided by modulus of it divided by root of a square plus b square where x1 and y1 is the point from which we are measuring the distance for this line. So in our case x1 y1 is 0 comma 0 because we are doing from the origin. So in our case we get modulus of minus c divided by root of a square plus b square. So modulus of minus c is just the same thing as modulus of c and root of a square plus b square in our case comes out to be 25 plus 1 that is root 26. So we have mod c by root 26. This is given out to be 1 by root 26 which would imply mod c is equal to 1 and that would imply c could be plus or minus 1. So we get two answers. What are our two answers? One is for c being plus 1 we have 5y plus x is equal to 1 and in the other case we get 5y plus x is equal to minus 1 for the other choice. So how does this happen? What is actually happening here? If we try to plot our lines. So we have two lines which we were looking at which is 5y plus x is equal to 1 and 5y plus x is equal to minus 1. And from this we get the intercepts to be, the intercept form of this would be y by 1 by 5 plus x by 1 is equal to 1. And in this case we get y by minus 1 by 5 plus x by minus 1 is equal to 1. So in one case we have a y intercept of 1 by 5. So let's assume this is 1 by 5. The next intercept is 1 which is 5 times of that. So it must be somewhere here. So this would be 1 comma 0 and this is 0 comma 1 by 5. And our line is going through these two points giving us something like this. Let's call this L1. And where do we get the 1 by root 26 distance from the origin? We get it when we measure it perpendicularly from the origin. Now let's look at the other equation. So minus 1 by 5. So this would be exactly below this this way and this is minus 1. So this would be exactly opposite in this way at the same distance. So now we have these two points so we can also construct this line which goes this way and as you can see they are both parallel and exactly opposite to that 1 by root 26 you get this distance which is again perpendicular distance and it is also at 1 by root 26. So we have two lines which satisfy our requirements. One is 5y plus x is equal to 1. The other is 5y plus x is equal to minus 1.